Hello there. In this video, I'm going to show you how to design professional graphics with your mobile phone. So the app that we want to use is called Canva. There are several apps there that you can go and use, but the best app that I've used so far and that many marketers and many people would design use is called Canva. So click on the app. It's loading. So that is the logo for Canva. You can download it on iOS or on your Android device. As you can see here in the top side of the Canva app, we have where you can search for over 60,000 templates. All right. Now you can design by yourself from scratch or you choose any of the templates and design with it. All right, so let us scroll up to see the different templates that we have, right? So as you can see from here, you can even design animated social media images. You can design Instagram posts, Instagram story, logo, Facebook post, flyer, poster, invitation, social media, photo college, presentation like PowerPoints and all. You can design business card, you can design A4 documents, you know, maybe you want to design your annual report, blog graphics, brochure, Twitter posts. You can design infographics, Pinterest graphics, YouTube channel arts, YouTube thumbnail, WhatsApp story, and so much. And so So you're welcome again to the second module of this training on how to design professional graphics with your Canva. In the first video, I showed you what app that we're using, which is Canva, and the different templates that you can design using Canva. So now we want to actually choose a particular template. Let's say we want to design an Instagram post graphics, right? So what will happen is, we choose one of these Instagram stories, I mean post, and then we use the template, we just edit it, and uh, then we post it in whatever social media that you want to use, all right? So one amazing thing about this is they are already pre-made template for you that you can use and which makes um, your work very, very fast. So you can decide to use the blank template or uh, let me just go back that's the blank template there you can design to use the blank template or you can design to use any of the pre-made template all right so this is another template that you can use all right so let me just go back and just show you some of the uh, templates that we have okay for example we have very very nice template for example i like this it's okay to rest okay so depending on what you are posting about look at this silting black box very colorful all right look at a lot of templates that you can use so let's just go back let's assume that you sell food you could probably use this big seal all right but let's go back all right i prefer uh for now to use this it's okay all right so let's just, just use this all right it's okay to rest so you see you don't necessarily need to change I mean you need to start racking your brain for design so all you need to do is just to change this particular uh, but, um, text if you want to actually change just double click on it or double tap and then it's there all right so you see you can edit it all right but I like it's okay to rest uh, so I'm just gonna leave it at that Okay, then here treat your body to a good night Sleep, I think this is fine, especially if you are someone who is Into helping people to sleep well or to improve people's health You can use this so you can change the color if you want as a tap on it, right? It's already you see that it's highlighted, right? So you can just come here and choose the color so just click here all right after clicking here 
you can then choose the color that you want you can change it to this change it to this change it to this or leave it uh, or choose any of those colors here so we're just gonna leave it at that all right so you if you want to change you know all of these things you can change their colors too you see you can change the color uh, the way you want all right you can also reduce the opacity right opacity is how transparent or how bold you want it to be all right so this one you can leave it at that okay you can change the color of this background too okay and you see or you can just go back and just click here all right so that's gone back to the um, previous settings all right so after that you can then click on the button at the top right hand side just beside this my battery right just look at it so I'm just gonna click here that is where you can save your graphics so you can either save as image or save as so if you click on save as image it will automatically um, yeah it will automatically save so you can just you know, your saved you saved your design so it was already saved on your mobile phone you can continue or if you want to save it as other format all right you can just click on save as so when you click on save as you're going to see different option all right you can save as png which is a very high quality image you can see have jpeg um, jpg small file size image you can save as pdf standard small file size multiple page document right you can save as that or you can save as pdf print especially if you want to go and print your pictures i usually advise people to save in um, pdf this high quality all right so what you do is if you want to print for your clients you can save as high quality print and then you go and print and then you make money from it so i'm just gonna cancel this right now and then um, you can actually increase the quality right just click here you see different 0.5 x 1x 2x and so on and so forth so i'm just gonna cancel this right now and we'll go and check the gallery to see if our image is actually there so let's go to the gallery come here and then you see that the image is already in the gallery can you see we have the image there and it's so looking so beautiful so you can go ahead and post this image on your um all right guys you're welcome to the third module of this training so we already designed a graphics like this in the previous video so we'll just go back we'll go back and see other things that we can do so you can go ahead and post such graphics on your um on your social media like instagram that we posted for you can also use that in your status and even facebook right yeah so now if you want to see this are my designs the my previous designs okay you can go ahead and see the designs that you have already created it will all appear here so um you can just click here that is where the design is but if you want to create a new design you click on this plus button just below um, here so you just click here you'll see uh, new designs that you want to create so let's assume you want to create Instagram story uh, you want to create logo design you can go ahead and choose any of this and use the same method that I use um, to to you know to create that Instagram account if you want to create flyer let's say you want to print a flyer for you for your next engagement or for your client you can do that or a poster invitation one thing you need to know is this you need to know 
what exactly your client wants to do because this Canva, the free version, does not allow you to resize your image. So what you need to do is first know the size or what they want to use it for. If it's for Instagram, it's for logo, know them, then you come here and just create it. But if they have a custom size, right, you can come here and choose the custom size and width and the height that you want to use and then create whatever you want to create within that size. Because like I said, the free Canva here will not allow you to resize um, your image, all right? So let's create one more image right now. What we want to create is the logo, okay? So as you can see, we have um, different templates for logos. So I'm just gonna click on see all, all right? To see all the logo templates that we have. All right, so I'm just gonna scroll up, okay? And see different logos that we have. So depending on the logo you want to create maybe you want to create a logo for real estate you can come here and search for real estate for example real estate lo uh, logo right so you can come here so you see this part of um, real estate logo that you might create and it's not necessarily you have to use any of this you can just scroll up and see which logo you love to use for me I think I prefer this particular black one so I'm just gonna click on it okay so it's loading yeah so after loading right so you can just edit this right and just double tap on it of course and uh, we want to uh, so you just click on let's say Shola Estate okay state is spelled as this all right and click on the next one and say um, form your dream dream <laughs> dream home okay so as you can see this shola estate has come lower right is on two lines so i can decide to click on this um click on the shoulder it's on 24 i can decide to reduce the size All right um, yeah and reduce the size yeah or i can make it that same 24 but then yeah but then increase this particular um, stuff here just click on this all right let's go back and then widen it okay let's do that let's just um can click on it and then i'll just um you know increase the weight we we'll just drag it there Hey, it seems not to work there. Oh yeah, so what we'll do is this. Let's return it back to the normal size, right? Click there. Then we will now click on this particular to separate the Shola estate from the one below. So just click on this button just beside the copy and on the top where you can delete you know and all that so just click here so we ungroup them okay so you can see that they are now separate so i can now some ways and then increase the size as i want yeah so i can drag it there and then this one too and increase it so let's say um, seven, eight, yeah. Let's so drag it, and then I bring it down to this. Yeah, yeah. So, Shola Estate is as simple as that. So, afterwards, all right, you can then go ahead and also download your logo. So you can download it as. PNG. Now you cannot download transparent background 
until you, you are using a pro version of this app right so but i'm just going to change this to let's say free and then i'll just download this as png as suggested so it's been downloaded so you see just save it will continue so we already created a logo within minutes right within seconds and this is something you can create for your clients and charge them money for it right so let's go back and in the next video i'm just going to do the final run off of this all right we've now come to the final module of this training and i hope that you've learned a lot so far all right so i will just take you through some of the things that you need to know on this particular app all right finishing touches all right so these are some of the graphics that i've done before and this is the last one that we did here right yeah so that and um, if you want this is where you see the different design that you did you can come here and you just say um, you know your designs and that is where you see it. okay then you can here you can choose the designs you want to make and um, you know you can choose different designs right so now I want to teach you how to create um, in case you want to just create your own design yourself so i'm going to choose a blank and uh, design and create so you just come here and then let's say you want to choose uh, uh let's use another one let's use another one so let's say you want to create a a social media post right so let's just choose this or like I said, I want to create it. So you, you know, this one is very easy. You can just change it the way you want. But I want to actually create a blank one. So you click on see all, and then you click on this blank, all right? So as you can see, we have blank um, settings there. So you can just click on this plus button to add something. You click on this button, you see we have text. If you want to add text, we have images. You want to add image. We have videos. You want to add video, you have illustrations. We have shapes, we have stickers, we have logos, we have templates, we have pages, and we have parts. These are the things that you can actually add to this document. So let's say you want to add an image example as a background. So you can just choose the image here. You can choose from the images on your phone, the camera, or you can just click image here and search for different images you can use here. So let's assume I want to choose an image on computer, but you can search for images here let's say you want to search for um, cleaning all right so let's see cleaning is loading so yeah you can choose this one cleaning right so you can just resize the image okay so let's see simple design that you can do so let's say you want to clean cleaning so you can, this is cleaning so this will be our background so let's say you want to now um, write something on top you can also click on this plus sign again and then you click on this text and then you can add a text you can choose some of the templates we have here or you can just go ahead and choose the text that you want so you click on this, add some text right so you can now say um, Shola Matthew or well, let me just say SM cleaning service drag this to the top now you can come here just look at uh, below you I mean below this video you see we have um, you can bold it right you can italics it all right so you can bold the italics you can turn everything to capital later using this AA right and um, you know using this AA you can Increase the space, you know, you know, you can reduce it, right? So, what we want to do is we want to ensure that this thing, this text are aligned to the left. So, you just click on this, all right? 
here you are free so let's do this so you just say the same coin is selling so you can come here just tap on enter and then you have it there so you can increase the size right yeah great right. so the space is too much so you just click on spacing and then we'll do the line spacing now the oh no 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 that's not it we we'll use the line spacing here yeah, you can see that's reduced so we just click on done and then you can increase it if you want from here to right by dragging that okay or you can just come here and do the same okay so take it off and the black is not really good for that place so I'm actually you can use black so I'm just gonna change the color come here and then you can change the yeah, color to white so I think that is good for me alright okay. so you just choose here and then you know, and then done as you can see you have designed something this is something that people will charge you money for right so as you want to add your phone number and everything you can just duplicate this right that you click on the copy beside this delete alright Okay, well, let's go back. You just click on that. You just click on copy. See that it has copied it. Then you can reduce this. Um, come on here and reduce it. And reduce it or change it from here to whatever size you want to change it to. And then you know, you can add the phone number here. And of course, this one you have to make. You can delete them. Right, you don't want to add the phone number, so let's say I can just say um, plus, just want to add a plus two, three, four, four, eight, one, 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 and you bring it down here all right and then you can add um, something like a phone number uh, or a phone logo there or icon so you just click on plus then you go to illustrations um, or shit I think it should be illustration yes so you search for phone okay so you see phone there and then as you can see we have this is these are phones like this so you can use the free one in there right we have a free one here so it's just this black and of course you can change the color to another color so let's say you want to change it to white something white hmm. okay so let's pick a color so let's say you choose a white um you choose white there so one right, so bring it down you can actually zoom uh, this particular stuff image right like, click on done so you just zoom it with your two fingers right so that you can be able to place this very well zoom it bring it down okay. I think it's fine here just click on done make sure that you click on done before you zoom if not you just zoom <laughs> another image or something that's so it bring it back right so now this this top is not really showing very well right so you can add an a shape maybe like a rectangle and then you know you know you just give it a color so that this one will be on it so you just click on add then go to um, shapes then search for a rectangle if you can find it there you can just scrub um, but let me just say rectangle So you know, I have a right angle there. This is small. Um, you know, it's on top of it now, right? Uh, so just bring it down already. And you see that it is actually on top. So we want to make it to go down, right? So that the image will come first. But let us change the background color first. So change it to black, and then 
um, you click you click somewhere beside this delete button on top here this under this my charger button so you see this three corner click on it you see you see the arrow that goes up shows that you, you are taking off the arrow that goes down shows that you are taking it down so you click on down you see that that particular button for um, phone has come up click it again you see that one has come up right so that we want you to go back you click this click this again but we want it to go up so i'm just gonna leave it like that so you just click on done all right so um this can come down a little bit all right yeah yeah so you click on done you want to zoom again okay zoom again yeah so this one bring it down to cool yeah click on done and then we'll take it back to the normal position now you might say but this thing is too black you can choose the color um you can choose the color and then let's let's take this up again you can choose this black this black right and reduce the color so that it shows something in the background too if you want right you can, you can do that but if you want it to be pure black you can also do that so you bring this one back to position and it's fine like that so whatever way you want to do it you can do it like that and go so like i said this is supposed to be the last video but i want to um pause this right now and create the final final finishing touch to the video and then we'll close for this particular training but i hope that you've been getting a lot so i want to see you go crush it go make some money for this particular app all right so let's save this and save it and just save it as image so saving i like the code that they actually put you know when you're saving like this one say creativity is inventing experimenting growing taking rules breaking rules making. so please just keep breaking rules keep trying keep experimenting that is how to do if you don't practice using this app you might not know how to use it very well so it's about creativity look at what other thing, uh, designs people are doing on social media and look try to copy and just practicalize it using all that you've learned in these videos all right so we can continue yeah so we finally come to the final complete video so this was the last design that we made uh, for SM cleaning services and you can see that this is simply amazing design so let's go back all right so you can um, you know you can create by now you should be able to create your own designs okay so there are different other designs that you can create using canva you can even create a calendar maybe you want to you know you know that sometimes you go to some people's office you see calendar right and uh, you feel like wow this calendar is so nice you can use canva, canva to do the same you can design certificate you can design class schedule comic stripe oh no, yeah like maybe comic book and all that you know you, you can do that so you can design comic book just look at it and look at all the designs that you can do facebook ad disadicate google calendar uh, google plus header graphic organizer you know id card you can design id card you can design invoice um for your business you can design label or label you can design large rectangular art and so on and so forth so i'm just want to show you the different other things that you can design using Canva. that is why uh we're here you can design mag magazine cover you know uh you can design magazine cover marketing proposal media kit you know different awesome things that you can design using Canva mind map newsletter photo book planner postcard presentations product label program reports and so on and so forth so i would love you to go try this out and after you've designed please try to send me 
um, your design right uh, so that I can also look at it and then you know we'll celebrate you together so I'm looking forward to seeing your first design um, in the group okay and I wish you all the best so how do you now make money from your design I know some people will want to ask that particular question so the first thing is look start designing for free design these things use this on your on your social media use it on your um, whatsapp status and when your friend is trying to celebrate a birthday go there and you know try as much as possible design something for your friend and you know and uh, upload it so when people put your number there you can put your number small area there and when people start asking oh we did this design for you we'll say it's you and they can contact you for design and you can approach companies and organization tell them you can do design for them and of course you can do social media marketing for uh, organizations if you know how to do that if you don't know how to really do facebook marketing and all that i have a course on that that you can contact me and get the course all right okay so you can actually do all of those designs and uh, you you are good to go so quickly before we round up i just want to show you some bonuses um uh, in case you want to um um get some professional um uh, images right for your designs you can go to let me spell it for you you can go to um on splash.com that's it on splash.com so let me go there you can go there and download some because there are some images on that camera that you're looking at that are not free and you'll not be able to download even after you've made your designs or you see that they will put canva watermark on it but if you go to a place like on splash.com this is on splash on splash.com you'll be able to um, search for images that you want to use. can you see this image beautiful right so let's as we want to search for cleaning service like we did the other time why am i am, am i supposed to create as cleaning services you know yeah so you can just search there and you see tons of image about clean can you see just something similar with that can you see beautiful images that you can download and they are absolutely free so you can just tap on them and then you save the image okay all right cleaning services let's say you want to work on um what again let's search for something what should we search for now let's search for house house oh sorry i'm clicked on login let's stop it i'm just go back i want to log in you can actually log in it's fine too if you log in you know um, it's fine if you log in so that is a splash Dot com. I'm going to show you another one. Let me just go back. Yeah. And splash.com. Um, on splash. Okay. On splash. It, it doesn't want to go back. Yeah. So you just have to go through it. So you can search for that, you know. Let's say you want to search for food or uh, the, what we want to search for the other time is house so let's look at the house so you can go and search for other things that you want to search for right in yeah, can you see beautiful houses you can use for your real estate website or for just to talk about something that has to do with house and then another website i want to show you is pixabay.com right pixabay.com right so you can download different images that you can use as your background in your Canva designs and of course even your social media right so let's say you want to talk about you know these are different images that you can use they are high quality let's say you want to you want to talk about um um let's say beauty beautiful woman <laughs> yeah so click on it and then you click on go all right or search so beautiful women all right so we have beautiful woman here um so it's it's it has the results as loading can see beautiful woman all right so these are the things that you can actually use 
for yeah, the time you see. Is it beautiful? <laughs> ah, wow, the, the, the side of tiger, right? So, these are the beautiful women here that you can use for your designs. And you can just Google different uh, image websites and you're going to see as many as possible. So, I hope that um, this video has really been helpful to you. All right. And uh, let me show you one more website. This website, you can use it to remove background for image. So it's called remove.bg. Yeah. So you know there are some images that you want to remove. Maybe uh, they are the background of that image. For example, let's see. Okay, I wanted to download this image. That is fine. No problem. So you see? After you've uploaded the image, just click on upload and it will change, uh, it will just remove the background for you. So you can then go and, so let's say I need to upload an image, uh, let me see where shall I browse it from, okay, um, um, go to the logo, no, let's cancel that, upload image, go to, um, to alright, so, uh, let me let me see from this myself, right? So um, let's as you know, remove the button of this uploading. All right, right. So it's prepared. It's uploading. Okay. I think it's working on it in the background. Yeah. Can you see? It's removed all the, and very clean. I removed all the background this is the original image wow this is awesome and identify everything and remove all the background so this is all the background you remove it so you can just click on this image and just save the image right yeah just click on image save it and then you can use it for your design so uh this is where we're going to stop and i hope you've learned from this video I want to go, I want to see you go do amazing things with your Canva design, go crash it and make the best. Have a lovely time. Bye.